According to those of you who flunked geography at school, Sweden is only famous for IKEA, ABBA, and some of the most spectacular adult material ever produced. But if you thought that Swedish plans for world domination ended with Roxette, you'd be wrong. Meet the new rock stars of gaming, ready to take America by storm, virtually. But it's a fact, we are one of the best female teams in the world. So it's not like, it's not bullshit or anything, that we are, we're really working hard to be the best female team. And why the hell should we listen to all the other people? Like, we're, we can be whoever we want to be, and if they're gonna talk shit about us, then fuck them, it doesn't matter. It's about us, and, and we don't have to care about them. So if we're cool with who we are, then, then I, I don't matter. have to care. I don't have to care about people that flames me. No, I can care about the people who really likes me, and that's what I'm. I'm I mean, I'm playing for myself, and I'm playing for because I'm think I'm thinking it's really fun. Mm -hmm. I'm not playing for anybody else. Okay, this is what the girls said as a group, but when we got them alone, their answers sounded a little bit different. Who pisses you off the most? Selena. Why? I don't know. I think I think it's because she's so young, and she's she is the youngest on the team. So she she says things without thinking sometimes. I'm the one. I'm joking a lot, and I'm probably the most cocky one as well. So why? I don't know. I guess I'm. No, I don't know. I just have more attitude than the rest of them. <laughs> We're here to to show the world that females can play Counter-Strike at the same level as most of the male population out there. And how good are you, Sophie? Well, that's a tough question. <laughs> what do you see as your role in the group? Who are you in the dynamics um, of the group? I'm very quiet, I think. I'm uh, the calm one. I always agree with everything because I don't want to get into these major fights and arguments about stuff. Let me ask you this. If you were stranded on a desert island, yeah. which of the other girls would you like to be with? Thelma. She got the brains. She's really good at surviving by herself. Who would you say is, is the most dominating member of the group? Uh, Aurora, absolutely. If I don't like the girl that day, I'll tell her. I'll say, look. You're pissing me off. I'm muting you, or mute me, because I'm going to say some pretty nasty things. Hey, well, if we're talking about love, do you guys, would you ever consider dating or falling in love with another gamer? Of course. Yeah, I think everyone. I think all of us have. Has had. Yeah. <laughs> It's when much easier. I mean, we don't have a life, so it's much easier to date a gamer. Yeah. Probably. And we're playing at the same time. Yeah, but you have the same at the same time. If you do go out and lose to another girl team, and we're out here, we, we have a mission to be the best and to beat guys at their own game. So it's like if we go and lose to girls, <laughs> then how are we ever going to win against guys if girls are so bad? Yeah. So that's why we, when we do play against girls, we are very, very, very determined to kick butt. How do you see uh, Playus in the overall scheme of your own career? I think it's really important for our career. Absolutely. It's it's going to take us somewhere that's never been done before. It's untouched countryside. I mean, it, it's really, really interesting concept and I think it's really interesting for the everyday person as well as the gamer to, to just see what really goes on behind the scenes. W what happens? How, how does a team function when people aren't watching? And I think that's extremely interesting and it's going to be fun. For sure. Is it going to be challenging? Absolutely. Twelve weeks with those girls? Every single day? Are we kidding? <laughs>